G'day guys and girls, how you going? It's your boy Jable1990 and welcome to Deponia. No guys, this is not Minecraft, this is my new installment of a game that I'm going to be doing a let's play of and I want your guys approval. So, what I'm going to do is leave it to you guys, I need a comment. After you watch this video, yes or no, should I play it or should I leave it? This is a game by Daydalic Entertainment, or I might be saying that wrong, Daydalic or Daydalic Entertainment, uh, probably sub-produced by Lace Bumba. It has to be one of the greatest indie games I have ever played in my life. I'm a big fan of indie games, and this game is just like watching a movie. It's absolutely amazing. So I'm going to play this through. I'm going to make each, every single episode 20 minutes long. So if you guys would like to watch this, just give it a go. Let me know what you think of this first episode, and we'll see how we go. So I'm going to start a brand new game, and we'll see how we go from this. What's this? Choose your inventory mode. Scroller, for sure. This is a very cinematic type game. Very, very fun to watch. It's kind of pathetic, you get all erratic. About dirty dishes congesting the sink. I'm tired of your bothers, remember our fathers. They dwelled in a world filled with rubbish and stink. But when all hope was lost, someone raised from the dust. He was handsome and cunning, his haircut had style. Courage was shining in his eyes. As he said, screw you guys, mind your own business. The sign of now goodbye. The sign of now goodbye. Junk. Junk. And more junk. A life of order and happiness. Oh, my bad. That was junk, too. <sighs> well, that does it. I need to leave this dump. Fortunately, this time my plan is foolproof. This time everything will work out. Where did I put my list? Heck, I really have to get away from this junkyard. Alright guys, so the way this game works is you guys are going to be able to get to help me out. Um, this first episode is just going to be kind of like an introductory to this series so you guys get a little bit more of an idea about it. It's point and click and it's very puzzle based. So the way that it's going to work is you guys can interact with me and help me out in the comments section if I've missed something or if you guys have any tips for me, you can um, go along and play uh, and help me out with it as I play I should say. But if you guys would like to play this game as well, check it out on Steam. It's only about 10 or $20 and it's probably one of the best games you'll ever play if you like to just play this. So I'm going to be doing it every single Sunday. So we're just going to get in ah, here and have a look. Here's my list. I'm just Let's go as we go. see. Seems like I've packed almost everything I need. All I need now are some provisions. The toothbrush, a pair of socks, and a bolt cutter. A bolt cutter? What the? Well, guess I must have had a reason to put it on the list. Daydalic are very, very good and very renowned for their type of um, indie games and story type uh, story games. It's absolutely amazing the way they do this kind of stuff. So I'm really excited to show you guys. I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, we just got to pretty much pick up everything we can. Um, I do. Kind My of father left this. me a trunk before he left me. I don't want to open it. I don't want to be disappointed yet again. Um, I kind of. I'm completely honest, guys. I haven't played this in that long. I'm I remember there's something under this cushion. I think it was the. Bolt cutters, I think. What's oh, this? Sock. A sock. sock? That explains why I've had such cheesy dreams. <laughs> Give me the green sock. That's one of the things on the list. We need to find the other one now. So let's um, come downstairs, maybe. Yep. This, this episode, I think we're going to stretch to 25 minutes. Um, we'll see how we go with it. Uh, we just need to try to find everything we need. Ooh, locked. Tony must have the key. Got ourselves a toothbrush here. Whoa! Oh, he's running away. What the? The toothbrush bailed out on me. Guess I should have kept it in a more germ-free environment. <laughs> Another note from Tony. What's she complaining about now? Will you please clean the bathroom for once? Yeah, right. In her dreams. Okay. <laughs> 
bathroom door. Nothing really in here, is there? Oh, what was that? I just seen that. Plunger. Give me the plunger. There we go. Grab that. Detergent. Bolt cutters. Here we go. Now, there's a way we need to try to get the uh, the toothbrush out, and I'm pretty sure I remember it's down here somewhere. So just point and click. We'll just come down here. Uh, you guys, I can't wait to show you guys like the second, third, and fourth episodes. It gets really, really fun. Um, it's hard. It does get really hard. I'll fill this up. I remember that you got to make like a remedy to kind of um, flush the uh, flush the toothbrush out, which I think it's just memo. Do the dishes already? They won't do themselves. Oh yeah. Well, I'll take that chance. You scoffed all the food yet again, and I keep finding your crap in the fridge. What the hell's wrong with you? Huh? <laughs> I don't understand the question. <laughs> um, so yeah guys, sorry about that. I did also think about making this, um, a let's play like with a, uh, with a face cam, but because it's so interactive, you guys would need to see everything on the screen to help me out as well. I didn't want to do that because it would limit that. Um, so that's why I just chose to do it that way. I'll have a quick look. See if I can find something useful in the pockets. Hey, there really was something in there. A sock. Cool. A sock. Awesome. So if we have a look at our inventory, we've got a blue... Ah, oh, that's right. I remember what we've got to do now. So what we have to do is we have to... Oh, no. Sorry. My bad. <laughs> I still need exit out. Something to do with the oven. Um, so let's... Crumbs on the sofa. It was something to do with... Yeah. Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there, but without something to put them into, nah, I'm not collecting them. Okay, so let's open the oven up. Turn it on. Nope. Uh, what can we put in the oven? I'm pretty sure we can we can light it somehow. So let's grab this maybe and put that. Adding in. oil to the flames is not part of my escape plan, but <laughs> it's an integral part of Plan B. Okay, so that's not right. We need to try to start the fire something. So if we grab the pot of water, put it on the hot plate, and we need a way to start the fire. So, oopsie daisy. So what do we have? We have some detergent, a hand torch. The hand torch might work. I need something flammable to start the fire. Okay. I might be, uh, yeah. Burn the note. <laughs> Not a bad idea. All I need is an... Yeah, that's what I'm doing. So grab this. Put Burn the note. <laughs> Not a but. He need what? Oh, I needs more. Okay. Uh, so let's. Where's the other memo? There. You're not supposed to eat on the sofa. I keep finding leftovers in it. <laughs> huh? Well, isn't that a good thing? So yeah, guys, I'm hopefully going to be making this a long time thing. I do want to try to play through the first, second, and third game. Um, so I hope you guys can really get behind this. I would really, really appreciate the support. Burn the not a but. I need some more for the. F hmm. Okay, so we need to find another note. Where's where's another note? I didn't see any here. Might be some upstairs. Uh, first aid kit. Can we get in there? Hmm. Locked. No. Nope. Tony must have the key. Okay, so we need something. We need another memo or something. Uh, where's where would another memo be? I probably already missed it already, and you guys have moving out at me. Something like this. Old escape plans. Huh. My old escape plans. Some of them weren't half bad. Nope. No, nope, nope. Nothing else here, I'm sure of it. Uh, let's have a look at the telescope really quick. Blech. Okay. Nah. Like always, there's only junk on TV. <laughs> uh, what am I missing here? Suitcase. To the living area. Sure, there's a memo somewhere. The wash basin. What's that gonna do if I turn that on? Nothing. Blech. What gnats piss? <laughs> okay, where was this last one at? We might actually have to go outside. I think that's where we meet Tony, uh, which is out this way. No, I haven't finished pack. Okay. Alright, so we need, what else, I mean, we've got all the, I'm sure we've got all the memos. We can't chuck the list in there, that won't work. Uh, turn the sink on, maybe. Blech. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's I just remembered Whoa. something. Right here. Right there. The closet. <coughs> <coughs> huh, 
Not a chance. The handle is missing and I can't get my fingers into the cracks. So can we use something? Maybe like a fork? To pry it open? <laughs> huh. Not a chance. Hmm. What about the bolt cutters? Oh, snap. No, no. Huh. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. The plunger? Aha. Of course the plunger. So mouse hole. Ouch! The heck was that? <laughs> okay, so we I'm kind of not I'm not understanding this. I thought we have what's that? Four notes. So we need five, maybe? Is that what this is trying to tell me? Comes on the sofa. There's nothing else here. There's nothing else in the coat in front of Tony's house. What are we missing here, guys? What are we missing? I've already played this game behind Tony's house. Let's go here. No, I have. Nope. Can't go into there. I would nearly be positive that we had everything. Maybe there's something in here that I'm missing. Was there was there a note on the locker? If there was, or the fridge, or the thingy that I missed, maybe. Nope. There's nothing on there. Close this off. Nothing. Hmm. Interesting. So what else do we need? What else can we use? Here we go. Burn the note. Not a bad but I need some more for the fire to really get going. Hmm, interesting. Maybe I think we can I I can remember trying to get out of the out of a door or something somewhere and something happening. What's this? The door of Tony's room. Okay, let's go into Whoa. Tony's room. Whoa, what's ah, that? Ah look, there we go. There's the last a one. guillotine so I won't enter her room? Whoa, that girl has issues. I honestly wonder why we were ever together at all. Stay out of my room. You have no business in there anymore. Who does Tony think she is? I've got better things to do than rummage through her drawers. Alrighty, so we now we've got enough notes. I'm hoping so anyway. Let's grab these notes out and start the fire up. In you go! <laughs> now we need to grab the fire torch out and light this baby up. Wooshka! Alrighty. So now I think I remember we can grab the, the. We got. Okay. I remember doing this. It's quite simple. We have three different socks, two different colors. Blue and yellow make green. So if we grab a blue sock. I may not be an expert, but something's still missing. Ah, oh, that's right. We need the detergent. Where's the detergent? Detergent first, chuck that in. It's very puzzly, guys. I really recommend giving this game a go. I really, really do. You guys would not be disappointed. I may not be an expert, but. There's one. Grab the second one. Chuck that in there. Grab the fork. Dish this out. Whoa, look at that. The sock changed color. Who would have thought it? Awesome. But where's the other one? Oh, clear case of sacrificial color mixing. So there we go. Pair of socks. Now I remember there's a way that we need to try to empty out the um, empty out the contents of this. Maybe I think it might be. So if we grab this, if we grab the can of oil, and if we grab that, and we pour it down into the sink. Yeah, let's get rid of this thing. And empty out the oil. Use the oil can on the sofa to grab the crumbs. Yeah. Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there. Grab the wasabi bees. <laughs> I guess these will make good provisions for the journey. And I'm pretty sure we can also grab this, put some on that. <laughs> now the little bugger's in for a surprise. Grab the mouse trap, put it in the mouse hole. And There's nothing left to catch here. The mouse skedaddled long ago. Which doesn't mean that its plan was better than mine. Maybe on the toothbrush. Come on, brushy, brushy, brushy. Come to Papa. Ha! Gotcha! Got him. Ha! Gotcha! I'll make you suffer the next time I brush my teeth. So, I'm pretty sure that that's it. What, what else have we got to, uh... What else have we got to do? We got the socks, peas, we got everything we need. I've just exited again, haven't I? Nope. Okay. All that's missing is a bolt cutter, for whatever reason. Nope, I've got the bolt cutters, so let's go back. 
We've got everything we need, so let's get out of here. Let's pack everything in the suitcase. Well, no, we need to grab everything, don't we? So I'll grab our toothbrush, in you get toothbrush. Check. Bolt cutters. Bolt cutter, for whatever reason. Check. Pair of socks. Socks. Check. And the wasabi beans. Provisions. Check. Ha! <laughs> Seems like I've packed everything. Oh, I can't close it anymore. Oh, seems like I've got to unpack something, but what? Let's get rid of the wasabi beans. Oh, okay. Wasabi it doesn't beans. take that much space. Socks? It doesn't take that much space. Bolt I'll cuts. never be able to close the suitcase with a monster like that in there. I mean, I won't need a bolt cutter where I'm going. I wonder why it was on the list in the first place. <laughs> now it fits. Packed and ready to go. <coughs> ah, I think I just strained something. <laughs> hey, Rufus, you should save your energy for the unavoidable drop into the abyss. Yeah, thanks, Wenzel. You can save your sarcasm for someone less well-prepared than me. This time, I took everything into account. It'll be a stroll in the park. Ah, that's what you said last time. It took us days to remove the cactus spikes from your butt, remember? That's all toxic runoff under the bridge. This time, everything will work out. And when finally, an Elysian Orbit Pixie massages my back, I'll ask her to pause for a minute so I can laugh about you. Whatever. But say, can I have your stuff when you're gone? Yeah, sure, help yourself. As if anything in this dump is valuable, it's time for me to leave all this behind. Great. I hope you remembered to calibrate the harpoon. I'll do that later, after I've stored everything in the pod. Well, then hurry up. Well, you know that the Organon are always on time. There we go, guys. So I'm going to end this episode here. That's going to do it for episode one. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this. I really hope you do. So if you guys have, please leave a like and let me know in the comment section down below. I want to leave it up to you guys. Continue this series or not. I would really love to and get your guys' opinion on it. And we'll go from there. So episode two, we're going to fill up everything we need in the pod, launch this rocket, hopefully be on our way to a better life or whatever it is we've got to do. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all the support. Leave a thumbs up because it really does help me show the support. And I shall see you guys for episode number two. Hopefully. Hopefully.